Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I've been wanting to do some sort of analysis series on my channel, but I just haven't been able to decide on the format until now. Most people analyze whole set, which I think is a bit overkill, which is why I have decided to do a bite-sized approach and break down sequences instead. Could be any character as long as I think it's interesting enough to warrant discussion. And today we're talking about Mkileo's pilot. There's a sequence that happened recently at Low Tide City that I want to take a look at. There's just a lot of things happening that I want to highlight and explain. First I'll play the clip, and then rewind in order to talk about it step by step. Just avoiding damage here, not putting himself in too bad of a position, that's nice though. That might be enough. Ooh! Oh yeah, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone, he's gone. Oh wait, I forgot the stage! Bro, yeah. bro, buy less. Uh, true. And you're dead. True, buy less. Buy less. That's true. Alright, so there's a lot of a lot of things to unpack here. Um, it's why I wanted to talk about this clip in particular, because Menkaleo just does a lot of things right here, and it's insane just how much stuff he does in a this short amount of time. So first off, yeah. I, yeah, he like he back airs, he gets hit by four there, no problem. But here here we go. Like, look at this. Alright. Mkaleo side B's in order to avoid the Zare, or side B I think it is, yeah side B. Actually I'm not sure, they both look very similar to me. Might be Zare, might be side B, not sure. Anyway, he avoids it by side B because it stalls just enough. And then he air dodges upwards, not only to avoid Mars up air, but also to gain enough height and um, to get enough height and like get into position, so he's able to recover all the way down there. Like that's insane. Like that's an insane sequence, and it's not even over yet. Yeah, so he doesn't appear in case uh, Mars was going to be on the ledge, which he wasn't. And then here, here we go. This is like the big moment for me. So, I mean, Mars is uh, side being on the ledge, which is understandable, or grabbing. Not sure. God, they're so freaking similar. I am not that familiar with more uh, with uh, CSS, to be fair. But okay, so this is the sick thing. Like, Mkaleo drops down, double jumps, side bees, in such a way that he transitions from the aerial version to the grounded version. Now this is not easy to do, by the way, uh, especially not in a high-pressure situation like this. And then he actually managed to do it, transitions to the grounded version, which is like, has more hit stun or shield stun than the aerial version, if I remember correctly. Max paced. So that's insane. That's like really well done. And Mars thinking that, oh, I can punish this probably. Because, yeah, pre-patch, you would be able to. Pre-patch, this would have been lag enough for him to do it. But he does, but he can't. Because it, now it has, like, insane shield stun. And Ankyleo knows this. So, the appropriate response... He jumps. Because he knows that Mars is gonna grab him now. And he jumps just in time. And then... Punish it was forward air. Like, this whole sequence is insane to me. I popped off. I popped off very hard. But I, I also laughed pretty hard when uh, Morris tried to grab side B on, on shield. Like, you can't do that. Not anymore. And I think he learned that the hard way. <laughs> but yeah, I just think that's insane. That is really, really cool. And yeah, that's gonna be it for this video, I think. Um, yeah, I'll see. I'll, I'll see what I'll do about the format. It's just a pilot episode, but I really want to do this with a bunch of different characters that I play because um, I know there's there's always stuff to analyze and look at. But yeah, I think this sequence was really, really good, and I really, I just really want to emphasize just how incredible MKLeo is. Like, he did a lot of crazy stuff in the sequence. That just happened to... I wouldn't say happened to work out, but... The side beat to stall, the perfect 
directional air dodge to recover. The aerial side B into grounded side B, max spaced. Jump to avoid a bop. It's just insane, but yeah. I hope you liked it. If you did, please leave a like and a comment, and that would let me know if you want to see more of it, because I would be down to do it. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.